guys, so this weekend EA dropped this brand new 99 overall Ultimate Legend Steve McNair. He has 95 speed, 99 throw power, and across the rest of the board, 98 plus. He's only six foot two, but he gets that Slinger 1 release. Probably the best release in all of Madden. That or Generic 3 are the two releases you want. So Steve McNair, Derrick Henry, Aaron Rodgers. Those are the guys with Slinger 1. Also Joe Namath. Joe Namath's a popular one. And Dan Marino. And then Generic 3 guys are like Josh Allen, Randall Cunningham, Russell Wilson, Trey Lance, those guys. But Steve McNair is going to have Slinger 1. The special part about this card is he gets a discounted Gunslinger. So any of the other slots, he's going to get Gunslinger for 4 AP. But in that fourth slot, he gets it for 3. That means that you can get Escape Artist and Gunslinger for 16 AP total. And you can fit them both on your offense. Granted, you're not going to have any route comes or any O-line comes. You can't really do too much else. But you get the two best abilities. You get Gunslinger with Escape Artist on a, on a 95 speed Slinger 1 quarterback. It's worth taking a look at this card. He's good regardless, even if you just had Pass Elite on him. Or even if you wanted to do a Hot Route Master Gunslinger with maybe even... Does he get Fearless in any of these tiers? He might get Fearless. I don't know. He's good regardless, even if you want to use a Pass Elite Escape Artist QB. Or even if you don't want Escape Artist. If you want to do Gunslinger Hot Route Master with Long Range Deadeye or whatever. However you want to spend it. It's still a really good card. But today we're going to take a peek at him with the discounted gunslinger and escape artist because he is the only QB in the game that you can afford both these. So yeah, this is a sick card. He is 1.6 million. Cost me all my coins to get him. I do have, I, I have a little bit left, but I had to buy packs today, sadly. Did I say that? I didn't mean to say that. I sniped gold kickers and punters for two hours this morning before I could record this video just to be able to afford this Steve McNair. So hopefully you guys end up enjoying it. We're going to hop into a game with him. Let's get into it. All right, dude, let's go. I'm ready to have some fun. Get behind me, cup. I'm pitching it. Oh, that, that could have been a bad start. We're good, though. We're good. You suck. Dude, I want you guys to know how excited I am. Slinger 1 and Gunslinger. I'm going to be a laserer. I'm not throwing it, though. I'm taking off with McNair. I'm actually going to spin. Never mind. I got hawked down from behind. That's the, what's he, 95 speed? I knew he was in me, and I didn't get time to set up a good man-beating play, so I just called PA boot over basically stock with just an in route. No clue if this dude's in me or not. I have, I have not a clue. And to be honest... Not a care in the world either. Touchdown, 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 touchdown. What a ball by McNair. What a throw. That slinger one on the run can get a little scary sometimes, but he made it a good ball. That actually got a little closer than I thought it was. Guys, huge shout out to the sponsor of this video, Hawthorne. Now, if you don't know what Hawthorne is, they're a premium men's grooming brand that makes it quick and easy for you to be your best with confidence with skincare and hair care products made just for you. Hawthorne uses data from hundreds of thousands of customers to recommend perfect products for you based on your skin type, hair type, body chemistry, and lifestyle. Now, how do they tailor all of these products specifically for you? Well, it's based on the results of your quiz. Their quiz is super quick and easy. It's going to ask you a few questions about yourself. And based on the results of that quiz, they're going to tailor all of these products specifically for you. You're going to get skincare products, hair care products, and you're even going to get two colognes. That's a work and a play cologne designed specifically for you. I absolutely love Hawthorne's products and they stand by their customers. So if you're not completely satisfied, they'll retail your products based on your feedback and they'll even pay for the shipping. So there's truly no risk. And of course, I have a discount link for you guys. Head over to Hawthorne.co and use code THRONE for 10% off your first order. And that's going to be linked in the description. Start with their quiz today. Hawthorne.co code throne for 10% off. Thank you so much to Hawthorne for sponsoring this video. And let's get right back into it. Gun doubles. Oh my gosh. I'm going to lose. I lost the game. <laughs> I actually lost. I lost. I don't know how to stop gun doubles. Never mind. If he's going to keep his play actions that don't pick up 335 wide, I think I know how to stop this guy's gun doubles at least. He doesn't have a skate artist, by the way. Oh, shoot. I got a baseline. He's keeping the play action again. Scream at him. Scream at him. Scream at him. Scream at him. Someone get back to it. Jimmy Graham, you're so fucking tall. You tried your heart out, buddy. I can't die tackle. I was spamming X for five seconds. Do you think I would just run right behind him forever? Oh, that happens sometimes. When you shoot a gap, it won't let you dive tackle. I'm not sure why. And right there, I got it. That was the first time all year I've gotten it where I'm tracking someone from behind. I just couldn't dive tackle. Oh, I was waiting for a good moment for me to be like very like, just make sure I was going to make the tackle. And it still came three seconds late. Like, I was spamming it for a long time. And it's fine because this dude is dog shit. So him scoring makes it a better YouTube video. So I'm happy with it. You know what? I'm happy with it. I'm happy he scored. Oh, just take it easy, man. More people are going to watch the end of the video because it's a more entertaining, competitive gameplay. Therefore, the video is going to perform better. So you know what? Thanks, Beast Eats Now. And thanks for the game sucking. E, 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 E. Language, man. Language. Dots. I'm pitching it. 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 
Touchdown. 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 Close. Oh, I'm kind of bored. I want to bomb him with McNair. I want to throw from the pocket. I want to throw it. Throw a late, like a, like a bomb from the pocket with Slinger One. He's going to keep me in the pocket. Beautiful. Up. Oh, I got shedded by the fat. Touchdown. God, McNair. Yeah, I miss having Slinger. Slinger's fun. It would have been the same with Pass It Elite there, but you just get the ball off so much quicker. Dot. All right, got our two point back. We're up seven. Just have the tight end man dot. So the seam's taken away. I got to take anything that goes to the right flat, which is probably going to be the halfback. Halfback's blocking. He loves keeping that play action. He threw a comeback route, and it's a laser. Oh, Beast Eats now is two for two for 107 on me. Oh, this is crazy D. Crazy D. Back to it, baby. He's got a glitch or something. He knows something I don't because this dude's a genius. That's just a pressed third, by the way. And Charles Woodson got cooked on an inside pass lead. I'm going to bring my guys just straight in. And I ran commit. Committed. And I, I don't respect this guy so much. I'm calling coach suggestions for this draft. Entirety of the drive. I'm calling one of the three plays up there. You know what? This looks like a perfect stock play. This is great. This is exactly what I want. Beautiful. Dots. Tufty. Good catch, Evan Ingram. That beat me in. But what if he's in cover two? Dot. Throw the hitch. Throw the option route. Love to see that. Laser. So I got this play curls and I can't lie. It's pretty hard for me to put a good play on the field if I don't have like uh if i don't have a, a hot rod ability like i don't know what's my play gonna be something like this is this that terrible this might be okay yeah i'm just taking my smoke screen i had both flats he had a gazillion yard zone drops he had his zone drops on 45. i'm perfect right now six for six i'm this is the worst play in the game i played sim cfm rules qb only for three full seasons and won a Super Bowl with the eight and nine Vikings, okay? But that's besides the point. This is the worst play you can get. Shock H option is the literal worst play you can get. Let's see if I can come up with a good play out of it. Like this. And my corner route's open. <gasps> Laser! Perfect. Dot! Laser! Well, thank God I got all day. Andy had 19 quarterback spies on the field, so everybody was just sitting in the middle, so I just had to wait for both slants to go by. Oh, wow. This has been an interesting game. I'm faking this shit. Fuck it. I'm faking it. I'm faking it. Dot. <gasps> Dot! Dot! Oh, it's a laser from hell! Oh, Steve McNair! What a dot! Some toe drag swag! The dude got his feet in. Look! Oh, that was hell. I promise you, this dude is in a cage. He's in a freaking cocoon. At least like an idiot trips. An idiot trips is way easier to defend than an idiot bunch. I played perfect defense, but he's going to be able to scramble for a gazillion yards because I was in man. This should be D. I like the D. I mean, I got cooked. I saw that bomb pretty early too. Oh my gosh. This guy is the best offensive player I've ever played. I didn't think it was going to match like that. I thought I was just throwing it past the zone. Should have just waited. I had all day. Just, that's that's a terrible pick. It's a Texas route. I'm running straight to the left. Thank you. Thank you. Seven. Thank you. I'm taking it too. I'm taking it. Uh, I want to play defense. Jeez. Well, we just both threw equally terrible picks at each other. No, 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 no. Thank, thank you. I got on Jimmy Graham. I'm so lucky. Just take over here. It's fine. He's going to throw his comeback route, and he got really unlucky with the route bounce right as he threw it. This should be D. I just need to take this dig. Nah. Good playmaker. No, I need a tackle here. This is a hard tackle. Oh, no. No, no, no. Running back's my responsibility. D. Yeah, 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 yeah. Don't let him get the spike off. Don't let him get the spike off, please. Don't let him get it off. Damn it. Oh, no. I played it perfectly. Shoot. This is a tenth of a second away. All right. So he's going to get three. We're going to be up four at half. Oof. I'm just going to send five out of wide every single play. And pray to God somebody comes in. I think that's my best chance. He's blocking his half back. It was good D. Perfect defense. D? Should be D. Should be D. Should be perfect D. Should be perfect D. Yes. Yeah. Oh, I played for verticals. Thanks.
Uh, oh man, that audible caught me so off guard. He hasn't gone to bunch all game. That was the first time he went to bunch. So I didn't have much time to think, think about how I want to defend it. And I think my hitch is going to hold down his own over there. We'll see. Roll out. Yeah, I'm, throw I'm throwing it. Dot touchdown. By the way, that is 99 Randy Moss. Uh, I did add him to the team. I didn't upload with him though because I suck. I'm a bad YouTuber. Touchdown, 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 by the way. One more stop, GG's. One more stop and it's GG's. That's verticals. I've got you in my sights. I had sights. his tight end. I played bad defense. Now I'm playing bad defense and getting stops. Like, I just played bad defense two plays in a row. Please be defense. Oh, my God. All right. <clears throat> Fourth down. Fourth and long. Fourth and 27. I'm going to put 30 flats on and cross my fingers that, uh, that we can swat the ball down. There's a cover four bomb coming from the trip side, probably. Or a cover two bomb, mostly. It's not really a cover four bomb. And he checked down on fourth and 27. Have I audible the gun tray all game? I don't know. I don't know if I have, other than like maybe two point conversions. I can play McNair. Damn it. So he's using this safety here. He's just going to use the bomb, but hopefully my wheel or my curl gets open enough for me to get yards off of. I, I can lowball this. That's a D lineman. All right. No huddle. Maybe my wheel will get open. Nah, it's man coverage. Shoot. Oh, he let me throw this. No, he didn't. Damn it. That was a master class on how to not have an offensive drive. Kind of like my D right here. Yeah, it's perfect defense. No, it's not. Yeah, it is. He could have thrown the comeback. Way to get back, Night Train Lane. Jeez, dude. Okay, I did play good defense in the second half, actually. Maybe I, I had some bad play arts, but we didn't give up points. So. Dot. Perfect. Try it. Seven, please. Yeah, seven. Randy. Randy. It doesn't matter, but holy shit is this game terrible. Damn, couldn't quite get it, but GG. 16 for 20, 381, five TDs with McNair. Did have a good game with him. I, I didn't think I played that well, but still a good game. And that's a good card. Any card that gets a skate artist and gunslinger with slinger one, it's going to be a great card. He's basically Derrick Henry from, you know, December when he first was dropped. You know, just unfortunately, you can't really put any other pieces around him because you don't have AP to work with. So if you are fine without using a route cam or without using any O-line cams or, or whatever, you can use McNair and have a lot of success. For me personally, I'll probably stick with Cunningham, generic three with pass it elite and uh, an escape artist for 15. And then I get to have a slot apprentice. That's my favorite part about that. I like having that extra crossing route on certain uh, formations. Makes me be able to run a few different like extra plays during videos. So people don't complain about me spamming the same things. But regardless, thanks for watching guys. And I will see you in the next one.